guys, how is it going today? Uh, today we have a 3D, Element 3D text tutorial, how to make an intro, you know, just a text intro, really, really cleanly and really nice. And just before, we are 850 likes, the uh, introducing Plasma, Saw Plasma. So if there, there can be 150 people that can just go on that video, leave a like real quick, uh, it would be dope if you could. Uh, so just create a new composition. You're gonna put in 60 FPS and 1080. Create a new solid, Control Y. Go in the effects, go in Video Copilot, create a new Element 3D effect. Write text, I'm gonna just write a uh, tutorial, you know, generic tutorial uh, text. So you don't need uh, that 2D text, so you're gonna take off that layer, pressing on that I thing. Go in the solid, go in custom layers, custom text and mask, path one tutorial. So after doing that, we don't need any custom textures maps, but you can add one if you want. Go in scene setup, go on X true, and now we have our text. Shout out to CEOG, uh, he uh, gave me this font. The font is called Javelo, it's a bit big, so we're gonna reduce it a tiny bit. There we go. If you wanna make it even cleaner, path expand, you're gonna decrease that a bit. You don't have to add a texture on it. I'm just gonna put this, there we go, on the text. We're gonna import our textures, click on rainbow color. We're gonna put it in the description, guys, don't worry. You're gonna put the brightness up, saturation up to bring up these colors a bit, gamma, a tiny bit up, and the contrast. And if you really want a different color than red you can just change this up so i want some yellow red just mess around with it guys it looks all right you see all these details they don't look that nice i'm gonna modify it you're gonna go in uv uh, mapping uv repeat and start increasing that a lot all right there we go and up Words too. So there we go. We have some really nice textures. Gonna press O. And the first thing you want to do is go in the group one, group replicator, position Z minus two thousand, something like that. Uh, you want to go at the end of the layer. Gonna, you're gonna put, let's say, yeah, this. This should be good. Go in the rotation, and now you're gonna start modifying a bit everything. You know, just go there. Just put plus forty five. Put this here. Put this. Then at the end, put zero, zero, zero. There we go. Then you want to go in particle look. Go in multiple. Object. rotation random you're gonna put about 90 yeah let's say 90 at the end you're gonna put zero then uh, the placement random you're gonna put about three percent and the placement x uh, xyz you're gonna put the z about let's say this and actually you can modify everything you want so the letters are gonna be really distant in the beginning and they're gonna start uh, grouping up now we have a really small animation next up put some shadow on it it looks really nice so far enable ambient occlusion the s s a o density to 50 i always do that put the samples to if your pc is quite slow just put it at 32 i'll put it at 256 oh, yeah. <laughs> now we're going to get some really nice shadows on the text really realistic too damn that is so nice i mean occlusion is really necessary and now for the background just going to put that solid in the background start putting some cloud bcc clouds we have some clouds in the background so cloud speed you're going to put about about three the scale you're gonna put about 500 key watch the scale go at the end put uh, about 300 then we're gonna go in cloud color I'm gonna leave the cloud color on white but the sky color I'm gonna actually go in some yeah yellow but this looks already quite clean we're gonna add some distort RGB the amount we're gonna put zero in the beginning so the distort RGB is at zero we're gonna go from the, so zero to about four on that go here to put the rotation warp to about 300 and now it's gonna give you like this really nice weird background we have this little animation that we're gonna sync just after so this is gonna look really nice little flower background type of but I feel like the text doesn't really match the background so we're gonna go back in element 3d go in the environment we need a bit more brightness on that side a bit more contrast uh, more yellow on it so let's see how it looks this is way better cool. right so look at that texture really abstract stuff so what you want to add next is a new solid optical flare we're gonna do like a sun or something like a random one go in texture lens texture textured image we're gonna go on dirty it's the really it's my favorite one to be honest with you we're only gonna take this click on solo go on the uh, mode put the screen mode and you're gonna increase the brightness to 200 then you want to go into flicker smooth put the speed at 8 and put the amount on 40 so now we have this little texture lens texture on the text and it's gonna look 
really really nice we're gonna adjust um easy ease all the frames so it looks 10 times better and has more flow so select everything and just press f9 simply like that now we're gonna see how we can make it work with the same go in a new comp put 25 fps whatever really we're gonna start syncing it just to show i don't have any songs but you know just the idea behind it so i did make a twixter syncing tutorial so go check that out if you don't understand anything about this just go one um frame behind one frame uh, forward we're gonna put 350 go here about here put 50 all right so in the middle put another frame 400 and then at the middle of the end we're gonna put 50. we have two speed points and it's ready to show the beginning with all the nice textures and then sync the other beat to the text so if you have a song just sync that to the song pull this to the extreme left extreme right pull this down completely not completely but yeah about that all right so it's a bit too slow so we're gonna just put this a bit more up 550 that's nice all right so the second beat you really want to sync it when the edges are a bit cut off you know a tiny bit cut off and then when it starts to speed up so it's going to make it animate it perfectly just put some small black bars just go on cc draws put a2 actually so let's see how it looks guys If you want to make it more colourful, just mess around with all the colours on the BCC clouds or that. You'll get uh, nearly the exact same thing as the reintroducing, reintroducing uh, plasma or what I've done on the saw episode. So uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed this tutorial guys. As I said, if you missed out on the upload, the new edit that went out six days ago, go drop a like on it, would mean a lot. And um, yeah, if you enjoyed this tutorial, really clean text tutorial if you don't have any footage or that. And it'll look uh, quite nice. Anyways, uh, yeah, hope you enjoy. Peace out, boys.